Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your6 Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your USB stick displaying file system on support on your PlayStation 4. Coming up next in this PlayStation tutorial. So when you're on your PlayStation 4 and you're trying to transfer over video clips, saved game data, and you keep getting a pop-up that says file system is on support on your PlayStation 4 and when you're trying to transfer over a video clip in the capture gallery and you go to copy to USB storage and it brings up this error CE378570 USB storage device is not connected it will also fix this error so I'm going to tell you what you will need to do right now your USB stick is on support it probably has a different file format than FAT32 on it so we will need to go to our computer and format our USB stick. Let's go ahead and jump over my PC right now. All right, so I'm on my computer. Let's go ahead and open up File Explorer down here. File Explorer is now open. Let's go ahead and locate our USB flash drive on the left-hand side. Mine is the H drive right here. There's nothing in this drive. Let's go ahead and right-click on the drive and then go up to Format. Now make sure this is your USB flash drive. You do not want to wipe out a external hard drive <clears throat> or a different USB device on your computer that has storage. So make sure it's the right drive, then go to format. So right here, it will pop up a little screen and the capacity will show for the USB flash drive on here. And currently it's set to NTFS, which is not supported on the PlayStation 4. However, this is the format for your Xbox One. So if you're trying to transfer a USB stick between your Xbox One and PS4, it will not work because the PS4 does not support the file system NTFS. However, you have the option to put FAT32 or XFAT. FAT32 has a file restriction of four gigabytes. XFAT, if you have an external hard drive on your PlayStation 4 and you want to transfer over larger game data or video clips that are larger than 4 gigabytes, you will want to select this option right here. And then once you have it selected, go down to allocation unit size and select your allocation size. I'm just going to leave mine to the default allocation size and then go down to start. And then it's going to go ahead and erase all the data. So just a heads up, if you have anything in the USB flash drive or your external hard drive, it's going to erase everything and then go to OK. And format is now complete. And once this is done, go ahead and take the USB flash drive out of your PC and plug it into your PlayStation 4. Now let's go over to my PlayStation 4 just to make sure everything is working correctly. So I'm going to go ahead and plug in my USB stick now to my PS4. My USB stick is now plugged in and I'm not getting a pop-up error. Let's go to the same clip I tried to transfer over before and had the error. So press options on it, then go up to copy to USB storage. And I am now able to copy over files from my PS4 to my USB flash drive. Let's go ahead and press copy to make sure it's working. Press OK. And it's transferring over the data. So this is how you go ahead and fix the unsupported air for your USB stick on your PlayStation 4. If this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and leave it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 4 tech help videos coming up next on your 6 Studios.